everyone welcome back to my channel so today I wanted to film a makeup look using affordable and drugstore products and this is a look I came up with um, I linked all the products I used down below if you guys want to see more of me please subscribe you can also follow me on Instagram I'll also link that all below so yeah I hope you enjoy this tutorial and I'll see you in the next video bye so I'm going to start with my brows using ColourPop's Pomade, and it comes in this little box. And this is ColourPop in the front, and it looks like this. This is a new one. The one I'm using currently looks like this, and it's in the shade Redhead. And a little bit goes a long way with this pomade. highlighter and concealer pen I'm gonna clean up under my brow and also use this as a eyeshadow primer with my damp real technique sponge I'm going to blend it all out with my air spun loose powder using the same damp real technique sponge today's palette I'm using the BH and Carly Bible palette and it has 14 eyeshadows and 4 highlights and this palette is very affordable I got it at BH Cosmetics when it first came out it was $12 and now it's at Ulta for I believe $14 so I think this is a great palette for all over my lid I'm gonna use my Morphe E22 using the lightest shade and put it under my brows and all over my lid with my Morphe M433 I'm going to use this light brown color as my transition shade and put it on my crease same brush I'm gonna get this light purple shade and also add it to my crease with my Morphe M562 I'm gonna grab the darker purple Morphe N321. I'm going to use this darker brown shade and add just a tiny bit at the outer crease. Then with my Wet n Wild brush, I'm going to get a little bit of this gold for my all over lid. And to give me more of that metallic look, I'm going to spray a little bit of Maria Badescu Rose Water. Then with my finger, I'm going to get um, this lighter pinkish goldish shade and add it to the middle of my lid. Eyeliner, I'm gonna use my NYC liquid liner and for my mascara I'm using my mega length mascara by wet n wild for my eyelashes I'm using Ardell's wispies To prime my face, I'm using Wet n Wild's Cover All Primer. For my foundation, I'm using my Milani 2-in-1 
foundation and conceal in number 07 sand and in this foundation I just need one pump I'm going to use my LA Pro Concealer in the shade Medium Beige. For my concealer and foundation, I'm going to use my Airspun Loose Face Powder. To contour my face a little bit, I'm going to use Wet n Wild's Contour Palette in Caramel Toffee. This is how it looks new, and this is the, the one that I'm currently wearing looks like. I pretty much hit pan already, but I really, really like this to contour my face. I'm also going to grab a little bit of this banana shade to add brightness under my eyes. For my blush, I'm going to use my NYC blush in Pinched. For my highlight, I'm going to use the same BH and Carly Bible palette and I'm going to use a mixture of this pink and gold shades. I'm going to use Wet n Wild's pencil in the shade You're Always White. As you can see, I don't need more highlighter on, but because I have it, why not? I'm using the Makeup Revolution Shimmer Brick Radiant Highlighter. They also sell this brand in Ulta. And I really, really like this highlighter and it's only like $7.00. So it's very affordable. To line my lips, I use NYX and Coco, and then I add it to my entire lip. Now I'm gonna add Elf's lip balm in Nude. And on top of that, I'm gonna use Elf's lip gloss in Scott.